Hey y'all, welcome back to the start of a new vlog. If this is your first time here, I am Meek Lachey. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can come back and vibe. And if you're returning, thank you, I appreciate it. Happy Tuesday, y'all. It's a beautiful, blessed Tuesday, February the 16th. I tell y'all, it's beautiful outside. It's a sunny, beautiful day today. And I am in an amazing mood. We are currently at the salon and getting ready to clean, clean, do some cleaning and some organizing. And then I have a client as well. But after that, we we get outside. It's beautiful outside. I've been waiting on some weather like this, so I'm ready to go outside. But we're going to start with handling our business first. Our business. And then, yeah, we're going to go outside and play. But hey, y'all, hey, let's get started. We stayed there way longer than expected. I was supposed to did that, clean up, do that head, and hit the door. I end up starting to edit the vlog that's before this, and then some walk-ins came. Child, before you know it, it's time to go pick Junior up. So now I'm sitting at the school to get Junior from school, and um, yeah, I ain't accomplished nothing that I wanted to do earlier. I wanted to go. He wanted chicken salad today, so I wanted to go home. And prep his chicken and everything so when he got home his food was already pretty much ready but it won't take me no time to make the chicken but the thing is I didn't go back home to take the chicken out so I need to go by the store and get some chicken I do this all the time I forget to take stuff out and end up having to go buy some more and I got some in the deep freezer like child good thing about it is gonna get eight cuz I cook all the time as y'all can see but um so I gotta go grab the chicken, get him, and yeah, then when I tell y'all it's hot outside and I got this sweater and these sweats on, not sweater, jacket and sweats on, it is 71 degrees outside and baby, in there cleaning that salon up and then doing hair, I was like, baby, 
child and then the thing is i got like a sleeveless shirt on so i didn't want to take my jacket off i don't like to be over people head with my armpits out and stuff i think that's rude so yeah anyways y'all going dead and i need to answer this phone so i'm gonna talk to y'all once we get home so y'all i am home i actually came home and made junior's uh dinner slash lunch after picking him up from school and now i'm about to get on here and print out um i need to print out i realized when i was cleaning the salon that i have not printed out the new business license um salon license from state board and the last salon inspection that they did that has to be posted inside of the salon so i need to print out the salon inspection from last year well the last time she came the state board lady came around and then i need to print out the salon license and i need to look for the business license from when i renewed it last when I tell y'all I ain't got none of the new stuff posted and she's about to come around again. She should be coming around. Uh, I think she come around around like she should be coming around June maybe because she comes like every two years. Oh, not to mention my license, my personal cosmetology license. I ain't print that out either. I mean, they active. So when she's scanning, she'll be able to tell that everything's active and you know but i just don't have it the new ones printed and posted yeah how did i do that but anyways so i'm about to um pull up that stuff and print it out and then after that baby i'm craving tacos so bad and i'm so hungry i ate nothing we going in there to make tacos it's taco tuesday baby junior had a chicken salad but baby, we finna have us some. I'ma show y'all. I'ma show y'all. So we have a new dessert to try. It is Carlos uh carrot cake. I got it from Walmart. He be on like the Food Network on a baking challenge. But I'ma let y'all know. Y'all, I got my mom over there on the phone. She just talking. She only know I got on mute talking to y'all. But I'm finna make my tacos and my Zachary, but we're gonna do this carnitas um slow cooked pork but i'm gonna do it on my y'all know how i feel about the corn tortitas then we got some mexican sour cream and some mexican cheese and i'm making my guac so let's Let's get when I tell y'all, my mom was talking so much, I couldn't even walk out through what I was doing. But I got avocado, tomatoes, um, red onions, and cilantro chopped up inside of here. And then in this container, I blended lime juice, well, three limes, um, the some peppers, and... Um, what is it called cilantro and i'm gonna pull this inside of there and then i'm gonna put some seasonings like salt uh garlic uh a doy a do what is that called a doy i'm gonna have to look at the bottle <laughs> i can't think of it right now but anyways i'm gonna put the seasonings in there um and mix it up and put the seasonings in there I was trying to say adobo, but I can't remember the name of it. But I'm going to put that inside of there. Oh, I love this. Oh, my God. And then we're going to get around to the tacos. Okay, y'all. I got my meat on. I put it inside of a skillet. And I ain't going to hold y'all. When I first put it in here. It was giving dog food. It looked like some dog food. It smelled like some damn dog food. So, I'm going to put some seasonings in there. Y'all know I ain't going to tell y'all what to put inside y'all meat. But, of course, season it up a little bit more. Don't trust the people. And all we got to do is pretty much just heat this on um, a couple of minutes. I think it said like five minutes. I'm going to get me a little daiquiri going. I'm going to use the Bacardi 
focus. Try. Is it gonna focus for y'all? The Picardi Margarita Mix. It's frozen, it's in the frozen section. And I'm going to add this in. Okay, then I have a half a cup of, um, a half a container. Half of this is some tequila, some reposado. Is that how you say it? Yeah. And then I'm going to do um, uh, not even a half, so a little under a half of peach snaps because y'all know I love peach stuff. All right, we got that blended. Let's get our tacos together and get this in a glass. Right, there's dinner. We got the guac, the tacos, and the uh, margarita. No, that ain't margarita. That's a daiquiri. <laughs> y'all, everybody wants to be talking to me right now while I'm trying to talk to y'all, but my baby dad on the phone running his mouth. So I just came to tell y'all this shit is delicious. It's good. But I'm going to come back once he hang up. He don't know. He on mute. I just been muting everybody. Yeah, that food was good, but me and my baby daddy was on a, I hate using that terminology. Me and my ex-husband was on the phone for about an hour and 30 minutes. I done had about two and a half of these. Who you want to talk, talk, talk? We still good friends. It's good to be good co-parents. I'm happy I got a good situation with my baby daddy, ex-husband. Cause I be seeing people like be at they they um child's other parent throat won't have that issue. Like and even when I, I be like getting angry and cussing his ass out, he be like, alright me God. <laughs> That's right, sir. Let me get my way. Let me get it out. But, I mean, we've been... He been knowing me since I was a little girl. Basically. 21. So. Anyways. I ain't got nothing going on. Other than sitting here. Drinking my daiquiri. Them tacos was swinging. They was... Very delicious. I'm full as a tick. And now, oh, did I tell y'all how the cake taste? It was, it was straight. It was straight. It's worth a try. And they sell it at Walmart, like I said, over in like the cake section. But I'm going to try that red velvet cake from Publix that Lily keeps talking about that is good. It's matter of fact, I got some right over there. I ain't trying it tonight though, because I'm too, uh, I'm too full. I'm never. Let me stop saying that. I'm gonna. I'm gonna unbig my back. I will unbig my back. I will unbig my back before the summer. Yeah. Speak that into my affirmations. But anyways, today is pretty much over with. It's. Oh, it's nine nineteen. I ain't realized it was so late. We were on the phone a long time. Anyways, I'm gonna take my butts in here and take a shower, bath, whatever. What I wanna take a bath? I'm gonna take a bath. And lay down. Stroll through TikTok for a little while. Just a little while, cause I ain't gonna get heavy with it. I ain't gonna get extreme with the, the strolling. Just for a little while, cause I'm probably gonna be asleep quickly tonight, cause I'm tired. And I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. I don't know if this is going to be a week vlog, being that I just dropped a vlog today a few hours ago. And then the other day, so I got two vlogs, two days back to back. So this might be a week vlog, weekly vlog. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see how much material we got. But I'm going to see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Y'all ain't never had a chili and slaw dog. Y'all sleep. Get you some chili, make you a chili dog, and then go to KFC, get you some coleslaw, and put it on top.
I'm trying something different. I'm putting some banana peppers on there because I'm just being extra greedy right now. But the chili and the slaw, make sure you go to uh, KFC and get the cold slaw though. Good morning. Happy Thursday, y'all. Happy Thursday, February the 8th. Um, I'm at the salon currently at work. I have a fairly long day today. I think my last client is 8.45 and my first client at 9, my last client is at 7. So, yeah, we gotta, um, of course we gotta stop and go get Junior from school and take him home. But, so we got like a little break to go do that. Then we gotta come back to work. But I wanted y'all to spend the day with me at the salon. We don't know how this gonna go because It's other people here as well, other stylists here. Most times on Thursday, all the stylists, it's a total of seven of us. And a lot of times, all of us be here on Thursday. So, um, we'll see how this go. Because I know my clients ain't going to have a problem with, you know, being on camera for a snippet. But some of the other people's clients might feel some type of way. So, I don't know how that's going to go. Because, you know, people can be very self-conscious about their hair and um so you know we're gonna see how this go i'm gonna try to get look at this lady lady that ain't the salon look at her pulling on the damn dog that ain't our salon and, and, and that's another thing we got a lot of old people we got a lot of old people i'm gonna tell y'all soon i'm gonna tell y'all soon but yeah some stuff got to shake but um anyways let's go in here i'm a because people in the salon and i don't want to stand in the mirror and show people show y'all what i got on in the mirror i'm giving black excellence black history month i got my cup giving the vibes that he is heatering but um giving the vibes today with my little top that's got the black lady on it and yeah i'm up i ain't gonna show y'all in the salon because the mirror in which that i gotta stand in to show y'all clients gonna be staring at me like i told y'all y'all know older people don't understand why is she taking a picture why is she looking at herself in the mirror with the camera like they so i'm gonna show y'all in the um in the little uh building like you can see like the wonders on the buildings are kind of mirrored so i'm gonna try to show y'all on there let go y'all when you said your appointment is tomorrow <laughs> babe i pushed mine at two months <laughs> get okay, all my coins worth <laughs> Here we're basically just doing a root touch up of color and she's getting a black. She's already black, so. This client got a wash, blow dry, and deep condition. She's getting braids. Typically, uh, braiders don't like any oil or anything in the hair, but they like it clean, so she's a regular. She comes to me on a two weeks basis. And I gave her permission to get braids because her hair is in really good shape. One. One. He normally goes to the client number three will begin a relaxer retouch. Right. Even like um earthquakes like what? No, we watching that. <laughs> Your client will be getting color as well and a silk press. <laughs> Y'all ain't going away. Y'all been married how long? She said she didn't get to show y'all the end of the last client, the oh, the fourth client that I did the silk press and 
the color and still press on yeah because your girl had to hurry up and get done we was talking a little too much and i realized it's time to go get my boy so i had to hurry up so we're going ahead we heading to get junior now from school and take him home we'll promote something quick to eat and then back to work we go Child. but i'm gonna get back with y'all in a minute i need to breathe for a second did not get to show y'all this morning what I got on because some people's gonna be all in our business. Let me go and show y'all now. I'm giving Black History Month. I got on this t shirt that has this black girl on it and it says Shades of Beauty on the bottom of it. And then I have on some sweats from Target. Y'all know Target got the best sweats for uh, everyday wear. And then I have on clogs, my tan clogs, and gold hoops just. Yeah, nice and plain and simple. I ain't got none on my face right now. This morning I did have some lip gloss on, baby. I ate that off and everything else. Speaking of eating, I made Junior some, well, I put a meatloaf in the oven. I'm making mashed potatoes and broccoli. He gonna have to take his own meatloaf out the oven because I ain't gonna have time. Yeah, but we, this is how life goes. Just on a Thursday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, it's work run home take care of him go back to work get them coins by any means necessary but let's get finished so we can get back to the j-o-b okay y'all we are headed back to the salon to knock the rest of the heads out i think i got melanie tina i got five more heads to do and we'll be done for today for it's working i'm not tired i think what it be is that like running up and down a highway because i typically leave from like three to five i leave the salon at three and then i'll go back for five they give me enough time to pick my son up go home and fix him something to eat or either eat if i haven't ate and um come on back to the salon what really tires me out is really this back and forth because my salon is in Pensacola I stay in the outskirts so I have to do a tad bit traveling it ain't it ain't much I ain't too far from the, from the salon but that really is just the drive and the rush and come home the rush be really what makes me like uh but if I keep going I'm fine like I don't work six to nine o'clock at night and be perfectly fine if long as i keep going my back might hurt a little bit but long as i'm keeping a steady pace and not stopping i'll be all right i'm somewhat of a busy body child that's what y'all gonna learn about me busy by t but we headed back knock them heads out get this stuff done and get on back across this water and i said across the water i mean home gas I got and I'm gonna pass up the gas station and get back to the salon I'll get some gas when I get off you about to be sending you to prison <laughs> <laughs> I have to just, I your just, nails just, pretty got you a valentine she <laughs> yeah, his name Bob Bob uh huh hmm okay, okay. Her name Bob you don't even know what that is do you <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying it sound like <laughs> I always make my relaxed clients sit under the dryer so we don't put more stress on their hair with the blow dryer. All right, you can lean on me. Did y'all see Tasia? Oh my god. <laughs> You can have a monkey face. Yeah, just like they changed now and them girls getting them slimmer bodies and they stuff playing out now. I've been through that. Yeah. 
Y'all know how I'm trying. They don't wait today. Uh, today, first grade. This is the first grader now. <laughs> she brought two butcher knives to school. <laughs> no. Yes. With the intent. <laughs> uh -uh. Guys, we're home. We're finally home. It's 9:40. I came home and I end up eating some of them leftovers. Leftovers. I end up eating some of the food that I made for Junior. Oh earlier the meatloaf and stuff and took me a quick bath i was too scared to even lay there in the tub for too long because yeah i was like i'm probably gonna fall asleep because i'm sleepy so yeah we made it through a day made it through another day back at it tomorrow same thing tomorrow I ain't even show y'all my last two clients that I did because at that point I was just tired and ready to just get finished and go home. So, yeah. Like I said, back at it tomorrow. Same thing, same routine. Clients, clients, clients. Go get Junior, bring him home, fix him something to eat, go back to work. But ain't God good. I asked for this. I asked for business to pick back up. Keep it coming, God. Thank you. I appreciate it. Anyways, thank, uh, speaking of appreciate, thank you for coming over here, my new subscribers. And thank you for subscribing. I am so happy to have you here. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Make sure y'all tell a friend to tell a friend to come over and join us. Watch me grow. Watch me grow. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I probably should be ending this vlog, but I'm not gonna end it right now. Yeah, I need to um upload. I feel like I got a lot of footage today. I feel like it, but I don't know. We'll see. But good night, and if I shall have to end this, I'll come back and tell y'all. Quick morning boost. I mix one of the bloom inside of this body armor. Hey y'all, happy Friday. It is currently 3.50 and I just picked, well I've been at work all day, slaving once again, but I just picked Junior from school, came home and fixed him some lunch. Y'all know that's the routine. When I have to go back to work, I come and fix, well I fix some lunch every day anyways when he get out of school, lunch slash dinner. But um, I threw him a quick meal together so I can go back to work and finish some more clients. Um, I made him some pork chops and this um, little pasta stuff and uh, some sweet peas. So got that done. I'm finna get ready to go. Well, not currently at this minute, but I gotta go back to work for five o'clock and then I should be off around 7.30, 8.00 not too long and then i might come home and put me some clothes on depends on how tired i am right now i feel like i got a little energy but i might come home and put me some it, then it's supposed to be raining what i'm talking about because it's actually drizzling right now but the forecast said the rain was gonna clear out in around eight o'clock so it's friday i might come home put me some clothes on and get outside but i'm gonna close this vlog out and start a weekend vlog is what I'm thinking I'm gonna do. I'm not 100% sure because it might be, I don't know, I might do a Sunday vlog because tomorrow is my grandmama's funeral. So I'll be doing that tomorrow and it's supposed to be raining. And of course, it's a situation where I don't really wanna bring y'all. I'm not gonna bring y'all. So we'll see we'll see how long i'm over there with my family whether we spend some time together tomorrow or not but if i shall go out tonight not the work we slide outside y'all slide with me so make sure y'all like comment subscribe tell a friend tell a friend make sure y'all come back thank you for coming 
And I'm going to see y'all on the next vlog. Bye-bye.